So I always tell people that wireless is 50% magic and 50% knowledge. Uh, we've got the knowledge part down, the wireless is a little bit uh, beyond us right now, but you can kind of think of wireless as, as a long cable that you, you can't see. So the neat thing about a, a wireless is a cable you can only run to one location, uh, whereas wireless you can run to a lot of locations, so you can have it connected. And then if that location changes, like with your cell phone, that cable can move without somebody have to restringing everything. Uh, some of the downsides you get with wireless, though, is our coverage area. Uh, we don't have the technology that goes through trees very well. So we need a lot of little towers so people can actually see, uh, see the location we're connecting to. Uh, whereas the cell providers, they, they have a lot of towers and they have mobility and they have good coverage. They can penetrate through trees. Uh, but we all know how well our cell phones don't work uh, and that's because they're mobile. And, and, and you give up reliability and throughput in order to have mobility, which is fine because in a cell phone you want mobility. But in broadband, you want fixed, you want high speed, you want good reliability. And that's why we do what's called fixed broadband or fixed wireless, uh, where we put an antenna on the outside of your house or building and run a cable down inside and then you're wireless from a wireless router, just like you would from cable or DSL, uh, except what's feeding it is the cable outside that happens to be wireless as well. And if you're familiar with the, uh, the coffee shop that has the hotspot where, where you can go on your laptop and get on there, it's exactly that same type of technology, except it's on steroids. We can go 15 miles, we can push 30 meg across it. Uh, because we're not trying to connect to your tiny little antenna in your laptop or the tiny little antenna in your phone, we're connecting to our fixed antenna that we have on the outside of your building. Then all the towers kind of feed back together wirelessly or through fiber down to the internet, which the internet is just a whole bunch of networks connected together. Uh, and we're just one more network connected to, that, to the, the greater internet. So when we say we bring internet to your door, we literally bring the internet right to your door.